Telegraph Road, is that good? Five South. What the? How am I at the Five South? Am I on the right street? Lakewood? Oh, fuck! Five South is that way. Oh my god. That means I'm going west. That's not right. Fuck! <sighs> so, shall I try and figure this out on my own, or should I consult the map? Maybe I should ask for directions. What a novel idea. First, let me make some sort of turn here. Oh, d Maybe I will ask someone for directions. Poop! Crap, crap, crap. Telegraph. That sounds familiar, but I don't know... I don't know... Wait, this is the 19... What the fuck? I think I was going the right way in the first place. The 5 Freeway does this thing where it's like, they call it the 5 South, like South, but it does all this bullshit where it kind of like goes sideways sometimes, so sometimes even though it's, it's called the 5 South, like, it's really going East. So I think it's tricking me here. The 5 South is actually going East and West right now. I actually want to keep going this way for a while. Well, that's what adventures are for, right? Getting lost, learning things, having new experiences. Uh, whoa, oh, oh, oh yeah, I actually did want to be, yeah, I want to be going south. So north from this intersection is Rosemead and south from this intersection is Lakewood. That's why I got confused when I saw the Lakewood sign. I thought it was Rosemead all the way down. <sighs> yeah, that sucked. Well, what's a couple of cents worth of gas between you and a friend? Oh yeah, good friend. <laughs> My front tire is starting to get this weird wear pattern on it that I don't like. And it's why I'm going to have to get a new front tire sooner than I wanted probably prematurely it's wearing in this pattern where the side of the tires like comes up starts to curve in and then there's like a mound in the center of the tire and then it curves down on the right so the reason that it's doing that I guess like my suspicion was that it was because the tire was low on pressure let me draw the shape for you again like imagine this is the normal curve of the tire right so it's got this curve up to about here, and then there's like a lump of extra rubber that's left here, and then it's down the other side, like a normal curve again. So I thought it was because I was running a low tire pressure, so the center of the tire was getting smushed in, and all the wear was happening on the edges, and that was causing it to leave a mound in the middle. That's what happens on car tires a lot. So, you know, I checked my tire pressure, and the pressure was actually good. You know, I had enough pressure in my tire. It was, the spe it was the spec, it's the factory recommended pressure. And I went to the shop that I go to nowadays, that I found, that I trust, and I said, what could be causing this? Like, why is this happening? I already checked my pressure, and he double-checked the pressure, and he said, yeah, the pressure should be fine, you could try putting a little extra, but what's probably happening is you have a dual compound tire, so it's actually a harder rubber in the middle and a softer rubber on the sides. So what's happening is the, s the rubber on the sides is wearing out faster even though the tire is properly inflated and everything else. So you get this mound of extra rubber in the middle where the harder compound is. And I was like, that sucks. And he said, well, it's fact of life. And I got bummed. So I've got that weird pattern going on. And I was worried at first that it would give me like a weird feeling in the bike, a weird handling characteristic, but it really didn't. It still feels pretty much normal. And while this is going on on my front tire, of course the rear tire has got the opposite problem where it's flattening off in the center here because it's wearing in the middle, and because I do so much highway riding and the sides are not wearing, so it's got like this round and flat and round shape to it. Ugh, tires, tire wear. That's pretty much the most expensive part of maintaining a motorcycle. Tires and... Yeah, it's, it's tires. It's just tires. 
it's a chain's not that expensive, oil changes aren't that expensive. Just freaking tires, man. Freaking tires. Freaking tires. Freaking tires. Freaking tires. Freaking tires. Freaking tires, man. Freaking tires. Freaking tires.